Good morning, fellow nerd fighters. We've become friends in the day. We've in the past. Today we're playing Cards Against Humanity. Uh, we have a bunch of beautiful, beautiful people right here. We have Rivex. <laughs> what up? Adam from A Heap of Games. Tally Ho. We have Walter. Hello. And we have Cat Clash. What's up? Honey, I have a new role play. I want to try tonight. If you you can be blank, and I will be blank. You can be a box that is conscious and wishes it weren't a box, and I'll be three consecutive seconds of happiness. <laughs> <laughs> You can be a bunch of idiots playing a card game instead of interacting like normal human beings. Okay, guys. Who put that one? <laughs> <laughs> and I'll be Angel Head Hipster burning the ancient heavenly connection into the starry dynamo. What? <laughs> oh, okay. I'm just confused now. You can be <laughs> all your needs on Pathfinder with 0.09% APR finance rating. <laughs> and, I'll be a mouth... <laughs> and I'll be a mouthful of potato salad. <laughs> <laughs> you can be somewhere else. <laughs> Oh, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> well, if butt stuff is good enough for Prince Ali, fabulous he, Ali Abba, <laughs> it's good enough for me. I need to say that properly. Ali Abba. Ali Abba. Abba. Prince Ali, fabulous he, Ali Abba. Well, if the secret formula for the ultimate female satisfaction is good enough for pussy, it's good enough for me. <laughs> Total sense. Uh, my dead son's baseball glove is good enough for a disappointing shot. <laughs> 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 I'm going to select that one, but I'm going to read the last one for that. Well, if the white half of Barack Obama is good enough for a whole lot of women, it's good enough for me. <laughs> Sorry, lads, but that third one is just the best. Yes. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. Oh, I'm the sorrow. I'm pretty sure I'm high right now because I'm absolutely mesmerized by... Blame. I'm pretty sure I'm high right now because I'm absolutely mesmerized by ass to mouth. Human centipede. I'd be mesmerized by that too, and I'm not high. <laughs> I'm absolutely mesmerized by the complex geopolitical quagmire that is the Middle East. <laughs> <laughs> political shots fired. I'm absolutely mesmerized by our new buffalo chicken dippers. <laughs> I'm absolutely mesmerized by pouring veg in those shots. <laughs> be absolutely mesmerized by it. Yeah. What? What? Come on, you never get the munchies and are just like, I want buffalo chicken dippers. In the beginning, there was blank. And the Lord said, let there be blank. Okay, let, let's let's do this next card, reading them. I'm going to read them. Let's try not to smile, even. I, I already lost. I already lost. In the beginning, there was a Native, a Native American who solves crimes by going into the spirit world. And the Lord said, let there be an uninterrupted history of imperialism and exploitation. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. In the beginning, there was teaching a girl how to hand job the penis. And the Lord said, let there be the male gaze. In the beginning, there was Jack Sperm from outer space. And the Lord said, let there be child protective services. <laughs> uh, I made it to the third group. I made it to the third group. In the beginning, there was peeing into a girl's butt to make a baby. <laughs> and the Lord said, let there be AIDS monkeys. <laughs> it's between the last two. <laughs> Through my sweat and tears. <laughs> Let there be AIDS, AIDS monkeys. <laughs> this year's hottest album is 10 Incredible Facts About the Anus by Apollo. <laughs> 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 this year's hottest album is Getting All Offended by the Act of Meetings with Medical Conditions and No Superpowers. <laughs> this, this year's hottest album is No Clothes On, Penis and Vagina by Taylor Swift. <laughs> That is by far my favorite album. <laughs> this year's hottest album is In My Village Burn and My Family Sided Before Me by the Beatles. What's dark again? What's your favorite thing? Oh, man. I'm going to have to go with... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> they, they were all good. They were. So they're all pretty good. They're all pretty good. Everybody join hands and close your eyes. Do you sense that? That's the presence of... In this room. Do you sense that? That's the presence of my second <laughs> Everybody join hands and close your eyes. Do you sense that? Oh, my voice, bloody hell. That's the presence of a zero whisk way to make $2,000 from home in this room. That's the presence of meaningless sex in this room. That's the presence of a child powdering my baby. That was the right choice. Oh, man. Oh, that was a good one. Those were all good. Those were all pretty good. You are not alone. Millions of Americans struggle with life. Hey. <laughs> Straight in. God damn it. I have the perfect... <laughs> <laughs> You know, well, millions of Americans struggle with Texas for every day. Millions of Americans struggle with being paralyzed from the neck down every day. Millions of Americans struggle with getting shot on the car every day. Millions of Americans struggle with these people and not threatening rags in China. That's actually true, that one. That's actually true. Right, with being last, the time to first, in two cards. Having the worst day ever. Hashtag... Big black oh, just, just... <laughs> Having the worst day ever. Hashtag ambiguous sarcasm. Having the worst day ever. Hashtag almost giving money to a homeless person. <laughs> Having the worst day ever. Hashtag anal bleeding. Hashtag fuck me. Hashtag pain. Hashtag blast. <laughs> Having the worst day ever. Hashtag how awesome I am. 
Oh man, this is totally the way somebody would hashtag something like this. <laughs> this is totally the way somebody would hashtag something like that. Oh, oh, I know, that's what I mean. <laughs> uh, the hashtags are? <laughs> Listen, Gary, I like you. But if you want that corner office, you're going to have to show me... Oh, God, no. Listen, oh. Gary, I like you. But if you want that corner office, you're going to have to show me these nuts. These nuts. You're going to sort of a mystical, magical voice. <laughs> you're going to have to show me the unbelievable world of mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to show me your giant dick, then you must fuck my ass! That's subtle, isn't it? <laughs> Blunt and to the point, literally. <laughs> oh no. You're going to have to show me doing the right stuff to her nipples. Oh. Come on, everything, correct. Yes. Tell me, Rebecca, you have to do something to your nipples, then you can't get off this. What? What? No. no. What killed my phone? Injecting speed into one arm and horse trick. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'd like to thank the Academy. I'd like to thank the sidewalk for keeping me off the streets. Armani suit, $1,000. Dinner uh, for two at the swanky restaurant, $300. <coughs> the look on her face when you surprise her with blank, priceless. And you surprise her with such a big boy. The look on her face when you surprise her with the basic suffering that pervades all existence. <laughs> when you surprise her with no penetration. <laughs> when you surprise her with seeing things from Hitler's perspective. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, oh, yes, yes. Oh. Basically, this picture like you coming home, and you just pull a pencil and bam. <laughs> if you had to describe me, the cards are using only one of the cards in your hand. Which one would it be? An inability to form meaningful relationships. Yes, Walter. Yeah. Walter, fuck you. No, that was not me. That was Walter, not me. Walter, Walter, Walter. <laughs> you know I struggle with that. You're You're like, like, <laughs> the tiniest shred of evidence that God is real. Okay, never mind. That one's Walter. <laughs> <laughs> Sucking all of the milk out of the yak. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Brandon. Okay. No, um, not. Yes, it is. Um, no. I don't. Don't. You don't. I, just, I think. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> That's totally something I would do. As king, how will I keep the peasants in line? Changing a person's mind with logic and attack. <laughs> no. <laughs> with all the bitches. Most likely. Just with all the bitches. Eating together like a goddamn <laughs> Just a whole country at one table. <laughs> That's a good giant table. A buttload of candy. <laughs> you get candy if you behave. <laughs> yes. Um, what makes things awkward in a sauna? <laughs> the tiger that killed my father. In a sauna. Whispering all sexy. All these decorative pillows. I think the pillows would get moldy after some time. <laughs> Ripping a dog in in a sauna. Oh, man. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was good. Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also dealing with generally having no idea what's going on. <laughs> That's pretty true. That's pretty accurate, yeah. <laughs> Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also dealing with being a terrible mother. <laughs> Is that M. Night Shyamalan? That's, that's quite the plot list. <laughs> Jackie, Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also dealing with my dad's fucking face. Brandon, why'd you put that one? Put anything in it. I, 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 sh- Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also dealing with lots and lots of abortion. <laughs> They're just all thrown at him. All the pieces. <laughs> all being thrown at him. Yes. Oh. yes. Oh. Okay, so if you guys like this game, you guys can go check out Rybex has his own video of it up and A Heap of Games has his own video of it up. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like because it lets me know what kind of videos you want to see. If you didn't like it, I'm not sure why you're watching this video. I'm your average ordinary everyday superhero and you may or may not hear me tomorrow.